guess it's time to face the cupcakes. Worried that I chickened out? No! I know you're not afraid of anything. I mean, what's to fear? This is a great honor. Right! Wait, I can't tell if you're being serious. Well, there is one part that I'm really afraid of. What's that? I'm afraid that you won't get any food because I'm gonna beat you to the Maiden's Feast. Dream on! Ah, sugar bunting. Where the sweetness is baked right in. No time to go to town now. Get in the house. Ugh, no time for lollygagging. Hello? Surprise! Surprise! Whoa. Yay! There is my Valoria. Oh, look at my pretty girl. I can't believe. I just can't believe. We're very proud of you. I think that's what your mother is trying to say. She's not even dressed yet? Can we do that after cake? Come on, cake first! All right, but come on. Let's get this good time over with. Oh, yes, cake. Now, where did I put that knife? Nobody touches that cake until I find the ceremonial knife. Ugh. Don't suppose you have another knife in the back we can use? I do, but your mom brought out a special one she wants to use. She wants everything to be perfect on your special day. Mom, I was just wondering, what if we fought the monster instead of feeding it? That's my girl! Now that's beast ender blood talking. Please, my loves, don't make this any harder than it already is. <laughs> Where would I? Lavina? What is it, girl? Any idea where Mom's knife is? We're late. If I knew, I would have cut that cake, shoved it down your gullets, and had us out the door already. Oh! Can I ask you about the Maiden's Feast? Weren't you paying attention in Maiden training? How many of these feasts have you organized? Let's see. A new Grand Mog appears every 14 years, and I'd have seen six of them, so... Hey! Are you trying to get my age out of me? I'll never tell. Where do creatures like Mog Chathra come from? They come from beyond the Plague Dam. What is Mog Chathra? The latest in a long, distinguished line of Grand Mogs to visit our land. Distinguished? Well, anything that lives that long becomes distinguished. I mean, look at me! <laughs> How much do we know about these Grand Mogs? The Grand Mogs have visited our lands for as long as anyone can remember. They hide in the wilderness for years, and then they come to feed. After feeding, they return to their land and... It is imagined breed. You actually imagine that? Eh. Why was I chosen? In every town visited by a Grand Mog, the villagers vote for the maidens who represent their town's best qualities. So in other words, beats me. Mog Chathra attacks other towns? Of course. Maryloft just had their maidens feast yesterday. That's how we know he's coming here next. They're a pretty tough act to follow. Amazing feather work. I want to go beyond the Plague Dam someday. It's forbidden! But maybe you'll be lucky enough to be taken there soon in Mog Chathra's stomach. Okay. I think I know all I need to know about the Maiden's Feast. All you need to know is how to look pretty in your dress. We'll take care of the rest. So, why don't we just fight Mog Chathra? Silence! Talk like that could ruin the Maiden's Feast. If you destroy the feast, Mog Chathra will destroy this village, including your family. Is that what you want? No. I'd better go look for that knife. And hurry. If we're late, you won't be selected and your family will be shamed. 
Maybe the knife is under this towel. <laughs> Never gonna find it. Dad, I hope you're not hiding that knife for your own good. <laughs> uh, why not? No, now where? Grandpa Beastender? Huh? Why so grumpy, Gramps? Because we're celebrating something that's a mockery of what this town used to stand for. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about this Maiden's Feast either, to tell you the truth. Then fight it, girl! Stand up for yourself! I hope you're not filling that girl's head with nonsense, Brahma. <laughs> Why do you hate the Maiden's Feast, Grandpa? Because this used to be a town of warriors. It's a travesty, Bella. Why'd we stop being warriors? Levina Clench and her ilk said there was too much bloodshed pushed for appeasement. So we went soft, became a town of bakers. Do you know where Mom's knife is? <laughs> Wouldn't tell you if I did. I'm not doing one thing to help with this shame feast. I'd better go find that knife. Don't you dare. I hid it for a reason. You did what? Oh, nothing. For me? Split it with you? Deal. On second thought, you can have the whole thing. Suit yourself. Now, where did I put that thing? What thing? Uh, nothing. Uh, I didn't say anything. All right, time to serve this girl up. But first, can I ask just one more time? Honey, why don't we just kill Mog Chothra? <laughs> <laughs> here, here! <laughs> oh, honey. Oh, we're going to miss your sense of humor. Majestic to behold. Oh, inspiring. Powerful. Mysterious. But Mog Chathra is more than that. Merciful and generous, Mog Chathra keeps our town safe. All he asks is may he pick some of our beautiful flowers as he passes through. Please come, Mog Chathra, and make your selections. Welcome to the Maiden's Feast. Show him what you're made of, Bella. I know he'll pick you! This can't be right. No, it's not right! I don't want that! Ah, oh, it should be in the center. Ha! <laughs> I make myself the center of any line. Center of math, maybe. No more ugliness, girls. Mob Chocolate responds to beauty above all else. Sorry, but beauty is nothing without a little heat. Hey, I've got a plan. I already have a plan, thanks. Attract Mog Chothra with my slender frame and be remembered forever as a hero. Well, good luck. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> when the monster gets close, you can use your candles to burn its eyes. Don't distract me. I think I've got a chance to win this. <laughs> hey. What do you say we break out of here? Trying to get us all to quit so you'll win the feast, huh? Well, it's not gonna work on me. I'm in it to win it, baby. You're making me hungry. I'm trying to make Mog Chathra hungry. These girls have it all backwards. Think it's attractive to starve themselves. Wanna trade something for a bite of that drumstick? Hmm. What do you got? How about the satisfaction of helping out a fellow maiden? Hmm. Sounds good, but not half as satisfying as this drumstick. Need a towel? Nope. They taught us to eat daintily in finishing school. I'm warning you, buzzard! I will pluck you alive if you come near my food again! Never mind. Just wanted to say good luck. Bye. Hey, Bluebird, can I get a lift out of here? 
Hey, does that costume have any thorns we can use as weapons? It does, but they're made out of chocolate. Regardless, I accept my noble burden, not with apprehension, but with joy. I give my life so that no harm comes to our village. No! I give my life! No, me! Sheesh. I hear him! Look, there he is! to wash it down. It. Flap those big blue wings. Just a little bit harder. Hey, 
How about we slip this cupcake? You can have the bottom half. Get back here, you crazy brat! That's my girl! She's doomed us all! Mug Chocolate's fury will soon rain down upon our 